Hello, I am Emma Claire. I'm in New York. Shooting for Queer Porn TV. Yeah, I mean, I have I really love Queer Porn TV. I love the work. I love um, showing my body. I love different representations of sexualities. And um, I love being a trans woman. And I, I love um, showing that off to the world. I identify like as kind of a semi-butch um, trans dyke. So my orientation and gender um, come out a lot um, in the way I dress, and the way I express myself, um, in who I cruise for. Um, I really like cisgender women. I really like transgender women. I'm really like gay for other transgender women. Um, <laughs> um, I love the like varying gender expressions, like. Um, Femmes, butches, and um, anything in between or outside of that spectrum. Um, yeah, I would say the way my body has adapted and changed. Um, I love it. I love the trans feminine body. Um, I love my trans feminine body. I think that's really beautiful. Um, I love the way that we can look at each other's bodies differently and like not just assign them by whatever's in our pants, but how we use it, how we express it, and um, how it functions. So yeah, um, I had some really queer like dyke sex I would say. Um, and it's interesting, a lot of people, um, for a lot of people it's like uh, their first time with a trans woman. Um, either they're coming out of like a sort of mm, cis lesbian space, cisgender lesbian space, or um, I don't know, it's just um, they haven't got that exposure yet. And I feel like um, there's a lot of positive energy and positive representation of queer trans women in particular right now. And I, I really like to be a part of that, so. I really love Chicago. Um, I love it because the size is so perfect. Um, most of Chicago, when people think about like the Windy City, they think about downtown, they think about, um, which is tiny actually, like, you know, it's like skyscrapers and um, an area called The Loop and the John Hancock Building and the Sears Tower. I'm sorry, it's now called the Willis Tower, but no one really cares. Mm -hmm. um, and then Donald Trump just stuck a, like, a really awful um, tower up there. But, um, <laughs> um, yeah, so the communities are really good. Um, the sense of like queer community is really amazing. Um, it's a very, it's like a city of a lot of distinct cultures and um, I think there are a lot of colorful neighborhoods. Um, everywhere is like, nothing really gets above like four stories in most of the areas, like outside of downtown. So it has a really neighborhood feel, but it's also very urban. Um, I love biking around town. Um, it's really flat <laughs> and it's really nice for just kind of like taking it easy, um, hollering at some girls and uh, yeah, going to like bars and cafes and stuff at night. It's really, really nice. Well, the way I have cruised before have been particularly in queer spaces. So like, you know, out to dance parties um, in neighborhoods where you know that there's like, you know, a pretty good like mix of people and stuff. Um, my thing is, is like, I feel like I'm pretty visibly trans and I really like that. Um, I kind of am just kind of like, hey, what's up? Like, <laughs> would you like to get some coffee? Would you like to get a drink? You know, if it's on the, if it's like on the dance floor, you know, usually I'll ask for a dance. Usually, um, you know, uh, <laughs> I think I've been direct as much to go up to people and ask them for their number right away just by like seeing eye contact across the room, um, which is really hot. Um, I love when, <laughs> I love when girls like check, like I can see that they are like sort of like scoping me out when I dance with um, other girls. 
and um, I do the same sometimes, so that's always fun. Um, I don't know, I get pretty confident, I suppose. Um, yeah, there are a lot of spaces, I mean, particularly where, like, there aren't too many trans women or true, too many trans feminine folk. Um, and so it does get pretty, um, well, I would say sometimes, like, a little bit scary for trans, trans women to, like, make moves and stuff like that. Um, I know I've, I've personally struggled with, like, issues of, like, oh, am I too masculine representing? Or, you know, as a trans woman, will that get lost? And, and, um, it's just like, no, like, I can be semi-butchy, I can be, like, cruising around, like, people love it. And, um, you know, it's just when you, like, put yourself out there and be really affirming, but also be, like, slightly aggressive, like, with your desires. And, um, I think, like, I've, it's just been wonderful, like, in my town and stuff, so. Intelligence. Um, I'm kind of a sapiosexual. I've just heard that turn like a little bit ago and I'm like, ah, I love it. Um, uh, a nice ass. Um, yeah, I'm really into like a nice ass. Um, thighs, um, either hairy or smooth or whatever, just like thick thighs that I can grab onto. Um, and pulling hair. Like, I think that's super, super sexy. And I love to do that, and I love someone else doing that to me um, while kissing or doing anything else. Um, it's really hot.